This happens if you block the narcissist. When you block the narcissist, they do not take it very well. You may have thought they were crazy already, but when you block them, that's when the insanity really begins to unfold. You will see a side of them that you haven't seen before. Because they cannot regulate themselves. They cannot replenish themselves from within. All of their value comes from external sources, which is known as narcissistic supply. When you block the narcissist, you are cutting off their fuel supply. You are taking away their life source and they're going to feel like they're in a fight for their lives. They're going to try to get supply from wherever they can. They're not looking for a relationship. They're not looking for a friend. They're just trying to fill the void inside of them. And that comes from other people. They use people to compensate for their feelings of inadequacy. They will try to extract compliments and praise from people or they will play the victim to gain sympathy. They will have grandiose fantasies of unlimited power and wealth and of having the perfect family and friends and living in the perfect place because it feeds their ego. It makes them feel special and important. Their value has to come from external sources. They cannot get it from within. But if they cannot get supply from positive things, they will devalue and degrade you. They will elevate themselves at your expense. It makes them feel powerful and in control. It makes them feel like they're superior to you. The reason why the narcissist targeted you is because they believed they could get supply from you. They may have targeted you because you're an empath. You're a kind, caring person who wanted to help them and they believed that they could get something out of you. In the narcissist's mind, your value is based on what you can bring to them. It's not about sharing anything with you. They're just thinking about how they can extract everything good out of you. It could be your physical appearance. Or maybe you have lots of money. Maybe they think you come from the right family background. Or maybe they believe you have good connections. Whatever it is, it's something superficial. It's something that only exists on the surface. Because they cannot connect on a deeper level. They cannot feel empathy. All they care about is what you can do for them. That's all that matters to them. As long as you're bringing value to them, they will keep you around. But if you're not bringing any value to them, they won't have any use for you. They might discard you, but that doesn't mean they're done with you. They can still get something out of you even if they're not in your life. 
they can still find ways to hurt you and extract supply from you. But if you decide to block them, before they get the chance to do that, you will be cutting off their supply, which could potentially cause even more problems for you. Because it will cause a narcissistic injury. And when a narcissist is injured, they don't just go away and lick their wounds. They will throw a temper tantrum. It will look like a two year old child in an adult's body. They will start shouting and screaming. They will try to intimidate you. They will make up lies and false accusations. They will start a smear campaign against you. They will try to get everyone on their side. They will try to turn everyone against you. They will make threats against you. Narcissists cannot deal with rejection. If you block the narcissist, it will drive them insane. The worst thing you can do to a narcissist is reject them. Because you're cutting off their fuel supply. They will feel like they're in a fight for their lives. And they will want revenge. They will want to punish you. Because in their minds, you have no right to reject them. It makes them look bad. It makes them feel bad. So they're going to do everything they can to make you feel the same way. When you block the narcissist, it will cause a narcissistic injury. And in many situations, they will go on an all out mission to destroy you. But if you're lucky, they may just never talk to you again. They may see that as your punishment. Narcissists are full of pride and arrogance. They expect you to see it as a privilege to be around them, regardless of how they treat you. So some of them may think that never talk to you again may be the worst thing that they could do to you. If that happens to you, you should feel very grateful. Because most narcissists are not going to respond in that way. When you block the narcissist, in many situations, they're not just going to leave you alone. They're going to want revenge. They're going to want to punish you. But I would still recommend blocking the narcissist. Because it's either that, or you just delay what is inevitably going to happen. And the longer you wait, the worse it will be. Narcissists feel entitled to do whatever they want to you. They feel entitled to use other people to get to you. So when you block the narcissist, it's not going to be an easy ride. But it's better than keeping the narcissist in your life. Even after you have blocked the narcissist, they may not want to leave. They may try to love bomb you again. 
They may try to pull you back into the relationship. They may give you a fake apology and tell you that things are going to change. They will do anything to get back into your life. But you must not trust them. Remember how they treated you and keep it moving. They've already shown you who they are. So do not fall for the love bombing again. They are not going to change. They might pretend in the beginning, but if you return to the narcissist, it will be even worse than before. Because then they will punish you for leaving them in the first place. They're not going to feel any empathy for you. They're not going to care about your situation. They only care about themselves. They only care about their fuel supply. So keep them blocked and focus on rebuilding your life. Focus on getting back to yourself. And when you're healed, you can start meeting other people. There's no reason to go back to the narcissist. There's so many people in this world. People who are not going to give you these types of problems. People who are going to take your feelings and needs into consideration. People who are going to be more understanding. There's no need to waste your life with a narcissist. They're not going to be any good for you or anyone else. They're not even any good for themselves. That's why they hate being alone. That's why they don't want you to be good for anyone after they're gone. Which is why you have to block them at the earliest opportunity. Keep them out of your life. They're not going to value or respect it. They're only going to tear your life apart and leave you to pick up the pieces. Block the narcissist and keep them blocked. Return to yourself. Return to your inner being and live the life that you deserve to live. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.